Aquarius, this is going to be for Simon, Rising, Venus, and North Node. Or Aries season. What's coming in for Aries season? Um, for Aquarius. You're focused on... Um, some of y'all are focused on love. But don't forget, for you to have love, the person need to be, you know, they need to have traits of loyalty there where you can trust them. Okay, Rigid is here. An oath. At the bottom of the deck. I feel like somebody is being a bit rigid and strict. What's coming in for queries? Um, I feel like you're seeing something and you're making a decision to walk away because of what you're seeing. Somebody here is blocking out stressors from work. <laughs> I feel like somebody is poor. I'm not trying to judge nobody, but I'm just reading what the cards say. Mm -hmm. Somebody been sneaking. Somebody been sneaking off with a person. I got Cancer and Aquarius here so far. You guys may be in love with a new opportunity coming your way. But yeah, somebody has been sneaking off with someone. Um, or they're trying to, but they, they're blocked by the person. Their energy is blocked out. They can't get to them. So they could just be having fun with another person. In the meantime, that's what I feel. When I, when when you find this out, Aquarius, you're gonna your feelings are gonna be hurt that this person falls. So it's gonna be hurt about that, but you're just gonna move on to the next thing. Like a true Aquarius. <laughs> yeah, you're going to find out that um, either somebody is like about to birth something new with another person or someone is going to have a baby with someone else. You just focused on your work or you paying attention on your work. I'm sorry about the light. Yeah, you're like, what? To whatever these um loss is or sadness because it's you can't you can't understand this you haven't um you can't see the forest from the trees that's what i'm gonna say right now or in, during this situation somebody has a new opportunity with another person that they love or that they're in love with You may not be able to see all this, though, because it could be discord going on among your friends and family. This Somebody is seeking refuge or, like, healing or nurture from another situation uh, because the person is feeling blocked out. You could be blocking other people because you're dealing with somebody new. Somebody is like, their nerves are getting bad. Because they over there thinking that they, they lost out. So they may hit you up like, what's going on? Somebody lost a job unexpectedly. They could be coming to you with it.
not knowing what to do. Somebody here had got a lot of options. And you could be one of the options, Aquarius, or that person with a lot of options could be you. Take it however it resonates. What is the outcome of this situation? I feel like it's going to lead to like you not being able to see something clear. What's the outcome of Aquarius? If some of y'all don't want to get pregnant, then you need to be careful. I feel like something's going to work. Some third party situations going to end. Yeah. There's going to be an ending, baby. Somebody feels it's going to be hurt. Either you or somebody else, Aquarius. Because it's only room for one empress. And the person that this individual is going to choose stands out out of all of the options. Or that you're going to choose, they just stand out strong. Mm -hmm. This is who the person see themselves with in marriage. And there's somebody looking at this situation like, where did this person come from? And who are they? Where did this person even start dealing with them? And kept them a secret. Maybe they haven't been going to see them. Maybe they've been at a distance. Yeah, they got new ideas for this person and everything. Like, great good fortune. They see... They see this could happen in April. Could be dealing with a fair man. You could receive, somebody could receive a message or a letter of news from a fair man that's like letting them know like it's over. Um, I'm not going to be like doing this anymore. Yeah, broken wishbone, which will not be granted. Maybe you were supposed to be going on a vacation with the person. They breaking it off. Or you breaking it off. Aquarius. Yo, somebody's like, no, I'm going to go towards this person over here. That's what they thinking in their mind. They may not tell you that, though. Mm-hmm. Because I feel like both people are, like, good choices. But, um... This one option is just everything that the person wants. Like, it's everything they're looking for. They know it's going to work. Like, they're secure in it working out with them. Okay. Oh, Lord. So, this person going to let it go. They're going to end it. Going to follow their intuition. Cut something off. There's going to be a message of concern here about it. Some of y'all could be dealing with Aries or Leo. And they're going to want to go on vacation with somebody else. Or they could want to go on vacation with you. Or you could be the person. However this resonates. 
But this is shocking. You know, it is shocking to all of the third parties that this person is changing their mind or changing directions. I don't think they thought this would happen. Yeah, somebody is going to get like what they want out of the situation. What's the advice for Aquarius in this situation? What is the advice for Aquarius? Oh, you need to walk away. Eight of Cups and Five of Wands. It's going to bring conflict. So, some of y'all, like a lot of y'all need to leave the situation alone. You need to reconsider walking away from the situation and stop giving to it. You put in a lot in this situation. This person is not going to choose you. Mm. Yeah, nine of ones. You need to set up better boundaries or let me not say boundaries. You need to have better standards, Aquarius. I feel like that's what this person is kind of looking at like they don't like. They feel like that could be like a downfall if they move forward with you or however this goes, however this is. This is your advice though, so. I feel like they do feel like you have good qualities, but they just feel like you don't have no boundaries. Mm -hmm. And if you do, you don't, you don't put them up. You don't show them. So therefore you don't have them to this person. You could be making exceptions for them or for people, for too many people. To just come in and do whatever they want. I feel like this person was with somebody like that already in the past. And it put more burden on them. Yeah, they don't like that. So this person dissatisfied with the fact you don't have enough, you don't have uh, strong boundaries. They feel like it's gonna affect the relationship negatively. Um, could be with family. So they're going to seek happiness somewhere else at a distance. Could be with a fire sign. Aries, Leo, Sag. Yeah, Leo sticking out strong strength. Page of Pentacles. Courtship and reconciliation. They may reconcile with a, with a Leo. And if it's not a Leo, they embody the energy of Leo. Yeah, because I feel like... I don't feel bad, Aquarius. Like, it's just not your person if they do this. Okay? Um, because this person needs a certain caliber of energy to uh, stick to their... I feel like this person looking for like an accountability partner. Somebody that'll help them like be accountable. You may not, you, you may not be fit for that. Like you just like, I don't care. Like this is your life. You, you make choices for yourself. You know. So yeah, what you need to do is put up boundaries. 
wait for what's yours to come in. Hold back from things that are not yours. Especially when you know, because I feel like some of y'all be knowing. Okay, put an end to something. Put an end to someone or things that are not given to you the way that you need them to. Mm -hmm. Don't give people what they want when they haven't, like, they haven't earned anything from you. Like, valuable parts of yourself. That's what I'm talking about. Get more grounded. Maybe you need to get more compassionate for yourself. Consider yourself first. Follow your intuition based off your experiences you've been through. Ask for help and guidance if you need it. Stop like being afraid of not asking for help. If you're dissatisfied, if you're dissatisfied with something, leave away from it. Don't try to like stay there and put up with challenges and add baggage on to what you already have to deal with. Stop looking at like the glass half empty. Like looking at things from a negative standpoint. And stop looking to like jump into stuff due to like certain, like as, how do I want to put it? It's like y'all are jumping into things, into the next best opportunity before evaluating yourself and looking at yourself as a common denominator of the issues going on in your life, Aquarius. Okay, so those were your messages. If this video resonated with you, please like, share, subscribe, and thank you guys. I will talk to you later.